Hello everyone, this is Ray Ward, uh, Outreach Marketing Director for BLB Resources, a HUD Asset Manager. I am glad you're able to join us today. It's a great way, great day to be alive and I thank God for that. You've seen all those acronyms that HUD loves to use. Well, have you ever wondered what in the world do these acronyms stand for and what do they mean? Well, in this video, I will be discussing three important acronyms that you should be knowledgeable of, especially if you're a real estate agent that is new or actively selling HUD homes. These three acronyms are called finance types. The first one is insurable, which is IN, which means that HUD home qualifies for the FHA 203B financing and does not have a minimum property re requirement repairs and may qualify for a 203k financing which is a rehab loan for owner occupants only. Now the second one is IE which stands for insurable with escrow which means that the HUD home qualifies for a 203k uh, FHA 203b with repair escrow and has MPR repairs of $5,000 or less. Now the repair escrow is the buyer's financial responsibility which is added to the FHA loan and is never a credit to the buyer. Please keep in mind that this does not apply if 203B financing is not available and utilized. Now, both of these, the IN and the IE, have a 15-day owner-occupant priority bidding period, which means that only owner-occupants can bid on these types of homes for the first 15 days. Now on the 16th day, if there is no successful owner-occupant winning bidder, then the home is open to all bidders including investors. Now please note that homes that are listed in IN or IE also have what's called a free look period for the first 10 days of the listing, meaning that we do not review any bids for the first 10 days giving time for all owner occupants to view the property and to decide if they want to make a bid on the property or not. Now after the first 10 days of the listing that has passed, on the 11th day we review bids that were submitted for the first 10 days to determine if there is a winning bidder. Now if there is no winning bidder, the home will continue to be listed actively and only available for owner occupants until the 15th day has passed. Now please be advised that any bid that is submitted on the 11th day and thereafter will have a daily bidding deadline which means that we will review bids on a daily basis until the home sells. Now the last finance type is the acronym UI which stands for uninsured. Uninsured finance types are properties that do not qualify for FHA 203B financing. Typically these properties have minimum property requirement repairs exceeding $5,000 or may not meet other guidelines for FHA financing. The UI finance type has a five-day owner-occupant priority bidding period which means that only owner-occupants can bid on these types of homes for the first five days. Now on the sixth day, if there is no successful owner-occupant winning bidder, then the home is up to all bidders including investors. Now please note that homes that are listed in UI have what's called a free look period for the first five days of the listing, meaning that we do not review any bids for the first five days, giving time for owner occupants to view the property and to decide if they want to make the bid on the property or not. Now after the first five days of the listing have passed, the sixth day we review the bids that were submitted during the first five days to determine if there was a winning bidder. If there is no winning bidder, then the home will continue to be listed, active and be available to all bidders including investors. Now I would like to also bring to your attention that these finance types may also be eligible for 203k financing. Now on the property listing itself on the HUDHomestore.com, you'll see a statement saying 203k eligible. Or no. If it states yes, then that property is eligible for 203k financing, which is a fabulous loan and provided by FHA geared to owner occupants that want to rehab their home to their preference. In a future video, I will speak more about the options on a 203k loan and the benefits of this alternative option to finance your HUD home. 
I hope you enjoyed this program and learned a lot since my intention is to always provide you with the best available information in real estate and marketing. I wish you a fabulous day with great success. This is Ray Warda with BLB Resources, a HUD Asset Manager, and I hope to see you soon. Be extraordinary in all that you do. Thank you for watching.